Hello, welcome back guys. So if you seen the previous video, then you'll notice again I look the same because I'm filming two videos today. Um, also sorry for the little bit of a messy eyeshadow there, um, but uh, I just can resist to just slap it on. So if you want to know what that is, please watch the next video. If you're here the first time, hello, my name is Dominica, and today, um, as in the previous videos, I was unboxing uh, some products. And in this video, I just want to talk um, about a also a online shop. Again, not sponsored. I just want to let you guys know and share my knowledge of online shops with you. So this online shop is called Glambot. Um, now, um, it's a little bit different than the other one because it's initially secondhand makeup. Now, don't worry because um, all the guys that work there make sure it's all clean and it's not manky when you get it. But it is you, so if you don't mind that, you can get some steals, like literally. So, what I got from them is only a few products, so uh, this will be a rather quick video. So. Oh, also, uh, I want, just wanted to mention, the delivery was quite fast, I think it was about a week, which is like acceptable, um, and the prices, especially if they have offers on, or if you have a coupon code, oh, it's really worth it going to have a look on there, and they have all sorts of brands, anything from MAC to um, Sugar Pill, and so on. So the first um, item I would like to talk about is the... Gerard, Gerard, Gerard Cosmetics, and it's um, um, classic lipstick, and it's in the color 1995, and it looks a little bit like this. I'm pretty sure I mentioned it in my lip swatches, so I'm not gonna swatch it again, but that's what I got. And to be honest, there is so much product in there still, and the price was quite good. Um, then the second one, which I also talked about before, is the Colourpop one, because I don't think they sell them in the UK. And this one is still this much in. So I don't know how much more could be potentially in here, because it doesn't go much further in. Then, I don't know if you can even see, it's pretty much that. So these are pretty much full size, I think. Um, so the next products are eyeshadows. So this is a Colourpop um, eyeshadow and it's Cop a Feel. Looks like that. Now I thought this one was quite empty so far because you can already see I hit pan and I used it like twice. And I thought it's gonna be a little, they're super soft by the way in case you're wondering. but. I thought this is going to be my perfect under brow because I find it quite hard to find something that is skin tone but uh, is not white. But I mean, not much is coming off. Now, you can't even see the swatch. I don't know whether it's how they clean this or... But yeah, there is that one. The next one is also from Colourpop and it's called I Love This. Now this one is still pretty full and you, you guys I mean can we can we just take a moment to appreciate this color look at this it's so pretty so I would definitely recommend for you to go have a look um, but it is a little bit hit and miss you need to be a little careful and uh, really know how to look for items. Now the next one is from It Cosmetics. Now I never owned anything before from this brand so I didn't know what to expect but it is in the Luxe High Performance Hydrating Eyeshadow Trio and the trio is called Pretty in Smoke and actually I think these eyeshadows, all, all, all three of them are really good. Let's watch them. I don't know if you're going to be able to see like this. Okay, this is going in the middle of her. Oh, no. 
five middle. The only down side of this is definitely the black because it's more like a gray. Now the last two items, again, Lorac, Lorac. Never owned anything before this little palette. However, when I saw it, and I know it's especially from the Pro um, uh, line, um, the eyeshadows are getting raised about. So I got this palette, and it's so pretty. And the colors are Cream, Nectar, and Mocha, and I love them. This, if you have nothing else, this, you're good. All you need. Okay, so let's swatch them. Swatching Mocha. I mean, hello. Then Nectar next to it. And then Cream. We're going there. And there is definitely pigment. They are super soft. Um, obviously, the most pigmented one is the darker shade, which is Mocha. So I got this little eyeshadow palette, I mean the packaging. I love it. And it's kind of sticky to the touch, which I don't mind, because it kind of adds to it. It has quite a nice size mirror, considering of the size of the palette. And it is um, True Romance eyeshadow palette, um, and it's called the Little Scene. Thinner. So we have the color Galore, T-Rex, Swan Song, and Brave Awakening. Staff. So I'm going to quickly swatch them. Bam! I mean, she's not playing with the pigment. She's not playing around! Oh my god, okay. So, oops, I swatched a little bit in of the other one. Okay, so, can we, this color, gorgeous. If you blend it out, it tends to get a little bit of a pink um, look to it, but I don't mind, it's so pretty. Then the gray one is almost like a gray green brown, I don't know if you can see, but really pretty. Then the white one in the palette, let me show you. So it's called Brave Awakening. So this one, actually, when you put it on, has a like a pink shine. To, or not a pink shine, but it looks pretty much white pink. And then the last one was the T-Rex. So this like light yellow skin tone shiny one looks like this. And I think they're really pretty. Again, the page is called Glambot. Of course, I'm gonna link it down for you in case you wanted to check it out for yourself, which I think you should, because let's be honest, makeup is expensive. And if you can get it cheaper, why not? And as I showed you, I don't think there is anything wrong with the products. Of course, they are secondhand. Keep that in mind in case that bothers you. However, if it doesn't, I think this is a great way to save some money especially if you're not sure if you're gonna like something you can get it for a little bit cheaper but okay that is uh, my review for Glambot uh, that is just my thoughts and my opinion of course if you don't agree that is okay as well but I didn't have any issues with them and uh, the older products came really safely packaged in bubble wrap and the package itself wasn't um, damaged so I would definitely say give it a go um, save some money and get maybe some two or three more products that you would usually wouldn't because you're trying to save so yeah that was it for my review um, and I even gave you some extra swatches I hope you appreciated that because uh, why not right why not so yeah uh, let me know if there is anything again that you would like me to do, any look that you would like me to do with the products that I showed you in this or the previous or the previous or the video before you get the gist. So yeah, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, please take care, be safe and uh, yeah, hopefully see you next time. Bye! You like my pin? Oh, it's so cute, isn't it? Oh, yes! <laughs>